Hello, this is Steve at GreenFuelH2O.com. Today we're going to do a quick video on how to hook up the 118 plate cell. We're going to go over the electronics and how to hook up the plumbing. For this video we're going to focus on the 130 volt input cell. And we have the controller here. It's got a dual switch, one that controls each side of the generator. And we've got a separate controller, variable, variable controller for each side of the cell. So what you have here on the controller, this is the power converter. You've got a switch for the, what I'm calling number one, and a switch for number two. What you do is on the power controller, these leads hook up to the actual generator. The black lead is the negative and the white lead is the positive. And they're marked here, one, one and two. So we just loosen the nut. We'll hook up the leads to the nut, just like this. You want to go ahead and tighten those, make sure they're tight. Look that there. On the other side, positive and negative. It's okay to reverse the polarity, it's fine, but once you choose a polarity, don't reverse it again after you've run the generator. Now on this side of the generator, you've got your variable controller. You'll be able to control the HHO output of the cell by turning this knob when it's in the variable position. This also has a full on position. I'll push it there, it's just going to run the power through this right straight into the generator's direct high power on. And there's your off switch there. This is simple to hook up. This end will plug into your wall. And on this end of the generator, we've got it marked one and two. You just plug it right in here, and you're set. And again, you've got a separate controller that controls each side. The generator has two 59 plate stacks. They're independent of each other, so you can control each stack with its corresponding controller. Okay, real quick, we'll do the uh, plumbing hookup. It's really easy to do. This cell has a six gallon reservoir. On the top of the reservoir you've got your 3 8 barb. This is the HHO out. So you connect your HHO out to your project to this barb here. On the front of the reservoir it's got uh, graduated marks all the way up to five gallons. When you fill your water, you want to fill it up to the four gallon mark or lower. You don't want to go any higher because you get a little sloshing. Don't want to get any electrolyte on the HHO output hose. These four ports right here, one, two, three, four, these are the uh, exit ports that the water exits out of the reservoir and, and into the generator. On this side, we've got the input ports. So in these four ports, this is where the HHO and water enter into the reservoir from the generator. Hooking these up is simple. The, in, the top on the top of your generator, these are your output ports. There's two there. Two on the back side. The output ports are going to go to these four input ports. And then on this side. We've got our input ports, two here, two on the bottom side, are going to go to these uh, output ports here on the reservoir. Very simple to hook up. Please refer to the documentation on how to mix the electrolyte. And uh, that's about it. 
This concludes this video. Thank you.